Time magazine just released its best inventions of 2023. They have a list of 200 life-changing innovations. And one of those was made by a Minneapolis-based company, a magnet that could be used to power electric vehicles, wind turbines, and more. Fox 9's Rose Schmidt sat down with the company's CEO today and joins us live to talk about this one-of-a-kind invention. What makes it special, Rose? Well, Time Magazine's editors say this year they paid special attention to growing fields like AI, green energy, and sustainability. That includes the Clean Earth Magnet, which was made right here in Northeast Minneapolis. This has been like a 10-year journey for us. We're a, a Minnesota um, success story. For the last decade, Nyron Magnetics in Northeast Minneapolis has been changing the magnet game. Magnets are a, really a, a key unsung hero of many different modern device and applications. So just your cell phone alone probably has more than 10 applications of magnets. Um, if you uh, audio and listen to speakers, they're driven by magnets. But CEO Jonathan Roundtree says the biggest growth area is electric motors that power electric vehicles and wind turbines. This company was born in 2013 out of a U of M professor's research. Our magnet technology is, is more powerful and has potential to become even more powerful than the magnets that are, that are available today commercially. Through a $17.5 million grant from the U.S. Department of Energy last year, Nyron has been able to pilot the Clean Earth Magnet. It's an innovation so groundbreaking, it was just named one of Time's best inventions of 2023. Made from widely available iron and nitrogen, this is the world's first powerful permanent magnet made free of rare earth elements. Our magnets have 90% less impact on the environment compared to the traditional rare earth uh, based magnets. Uh, and so very important in terms of being able to supply those magnets for energy efficiency, but also reliability of supply. Roundtree says there's a huge demand for magnets, but currently the U.S. relies on rare earth elements that usually come from China. Nyron's technology solves that problem. The Department of Energy says these magnets will also help the White House reach its 2030 electric vehicle goal. As we grow, we are going to look for other opportunities to, to build a factory and, and obviously it would be great if we could build one here in Minnesota. This year, Nyron has hired more than 30 people, doubling its staff, and the CEO tells me he expects the company to double again next year, creating even more Minnesota jobs. Reporting live in Minneapolis, Rose Schmidt, Fox 9.